All right, so it's going into one of my favorite times of year in Belgrade, and that is September, early October, where, you know, the weather cools down a bit, and you get the wonderful harvest of all the stuff that's been growing all summer. And I was walking through, I'm here at Kalenich Market today, just walking around, looking at what's up. And I was here today, like, um, I was here yesterday at a different market, actually, called Bailoni one of the other classic ones. Those two, I would say, are the quintessential Belgrade mar market, unless you want cheap, fast, and that's Zeleny Venice, that's the one for that. So three markets around the center. Um, Bailoni is in Dorcho, and it's also called Skodarska Piazza, or something like that. And um, this is in Vracha, this is Kalenich Market, and the third one would be Zeleny Venice, which is um, right by the main square, basically three minutes walking away from there. But anyway, anyways, this time of year, I was walking with my friend at the market yesterday, and it's like, how lucky are we to still have this magical market with these, you know, amazing selections of fresh fruit and vegetable for these prices. I mean, like, come on, like 400 dinars, like four US dollars for a kilo of raspberries. Like, where else on the planet can you do that? Now, mind you, Serbia is the number one exporter of raspberries in the world, so there's an abundance of them here. And, <laughs> I mean, come on, like, today at Zeleni Venice, I was there as well, and I saw that they were having paprika, peppers, red peppers for like 50 dinars a kilo. <laughs> it's ridiculously cheap, so you can eat here. And it's quality stuff, usually. You know, real food, not like any of this genetically modified or organism stuff that they um, like to eat in the Americas with all those Monsanto type companies um, just sort of you know they're all sort of messing up food with this predatory ca capitalism which is like most profit most most uh, lowest qual lowest cost and the most profit and to charge the highest price possible and just like this really predatory capitalism that is essentially destroying the planet and destroying the health of human beings and here in Serbia I feel we have a real food culture that is outside of that bullshit and look at this stuff look at all these independent sellers and there's a good chance that most of this comes two hands from the farmer because it's still possible for them to be here and sell their natural products that they've grown in small production Whereas in a lot of places, it's not like that. Any farmer's market would be ridiculously expensive. Whereas here, it's still real, still cheap, still honest. And there's a health food culture which is off the charts here. I mean, like, like here, um, and every market has like a health food store. So here's one right here. This is what they look like. They've got all sorts of organic products and stuff that's not organic, but has the same sort of ethos of natural and traditional agri agriculture. So. Really super grateful to be... Hi. <laughs> um, really super grateful to be living in Serbia. She must have recognized me from the channel. I don't know. Um, to be living in Serbia, to be able to eat this great food, and it's one of the main benefits of living here. Honestly. And it's something that never gets old. There's always some new product to discover. There's always some new healthy sort of... You know, the cuisine in the restaurants isn't that great. But if you learn the food, if you learn the, the stuff, if you learn the stuff and how to sort of prepare it at home in a healthy way and, you know, I buy a lot from the Greek supermarket because their stuff is often very good as well. And just combining the local products with the foreign health food products that are imported and really good and the fine food from, you know, some places like... You know, Italy is a really good one. You know, when I eat pizza on Sunday, it's my cheat meal, and I go to a place that imports the flour from Italy, and you know, so really grateful to be able to make me out of this, this wonderful food because you are what you eat, and lots of people um, eat a world of deceit, of fast food, junk, stupid stuff that destroys your health. Whereas, like in Serbia you really do have an option. Yeah, most people eat shit, crap, junk, but you don't have to. So thanks a lot, hope you enjoyed this video. Bye guys.